Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum dear students and viewers. Welcome to my YouTube channel Digital Learning Points. In today in today video we are going to cover the solution of assignment number 1 of cost and management accounting uh, MGT 402 and it is related to spring 2023. And further this uh, ideal solution of assignment is related to the examination system of virtual university. So topic uh, you will read it by yourself. I am going to uh, directly go to this assignment question to save the time. Uh, following information has been extracted the book of the leather products manufacturer, manufacturing company to prepare material ledger card for the month of January. So here the information uh, at January first company had 50 meter leather sheet at rupees to 10.98 per meter. This is your opening. closing uh, opening balance of the uh, leather material on 4th of january he purchased 2000 meters at rupees 315 per meter and uh, on 13 uh, 13 january he issued 1000 meter material and on january 29 he is again issued 750 meter material following information is related to the direct labor cost workers completed the assigned job to manufacture the leather products in month of january based upon following information and the company observed the healthy premium plan premium plan is equal to healthy premium plan wage is wage rate per hour is equal to rupees 104 time allowed for the job 240 hours time taken 176 hours Following cost incurred during the period to manufacture the product, uh, factory overhead applied rupees forty five thousand, closing finished goods rupees fifteen thousand, closing work in pro process or progress rupees five thousand. There was no beginning inventory in finished goods and work in process required. Prepare material ledger card by using first in first out people. Inventory valuation method under perpetual inventory system for the month of January. Calculate gross earning of the workers for the month of January. Prepare cost of goods sold statement for the month of January. So let's move to the solution that I have made in Excel workbook. Here is the solution: material ledger card under FIFO method. for perpetual system is like that on uh, first january we have a opening uh, opening balance 50 quantity at rupees 2.1 per uh, per unit you can say that uh, is equal to 10549 which is obtained by multiplying rate with the quantity on 4th of january uh, <coughs> company purchased 200 uh, units of materials lead meter uh, 2000 meter of leather at the rate of rupees 315 per meter so total amount 60 uh, 3000 or 630000 so we will write it here like this one 200000 at rupees uh, 315 per meter so equal to 633000 now next consecutive two days of the month at 10th january uh, how much meter is issued in terms of Meter 1000 meter has been issued 50. So as per uh, FIFO method, we uh, as method it is clear from the name that first in first out. So we have already 50 meter. So we will use this one, or we will issue this one 50 meter, and then later remaining 950 we will take out from the 2000 meter which has which we have purchased later. So 50 950 we will use the Uh, corresponding rate to 11 uh, 315 10,549 299,000 uh, 250 and 250. So uh, total uh, remaining is balance uh, 1050. So look at this uh, 20,000 uh, 2,000 plus 50 is 2050 minus 1,000 is equal to 1050. So remaining uh, balance is 330,750 on 29th January again. It issues in seven hundred fifty meter at and uh, it is finally taken out from the remaining ten thousand fifty, which has a rate three hundred fifty. 
so uh, 236,250 uh, amount of leather has been issued and uh, the remaining balance is uh, 300 and 315 we will get 94,500 in perpetual uh, system we will take it as a closing balance so uh, we will uh, coming from here here is the purchasing we had a seat our purchase the total amount is this and uh, issuance from here is uh, this 546,049 only and uh, this is a balance uh, at the end of the uh, month uh, January so in part 2 you are going to calculate the gross earning of the workers gross earning of the workers means we don't know uh, how many workers are there and out of uh, them um, out of them which one has worked 10 hours, 4 hours, 2 hours, 3 hours, 11 hours, 15 hours on the gross basis we have known that uh, the standard time or time allowed is 250 and the, all the papers I don't know the number of papers and the, which are the number of uh, papers are variable they have consumed 150 hours to complete this job so uh, as per health premium plan we are going to determine the gross earnings of the workers that has been used to complete this uh, job is wi wage income is equal to uh, our work uh, standard hours total uh, time allowed into rate per hour plus ts stand for time saved and uh, rate per hour into 50 percent 50 percent means that by applying this health premium plan uh, company assume that he he has uh, saved 50 percent in, in his production car so he is going to be and give the benefit of this uh, saving uh, this saving of 50 percent production plan to the employee uh, workers uh, in the form of wage income so wi is equal to we are going to 50 percent here as remember that this value varies from 30 percent to 70 percent but for simplicity i have taken the this 50 percent value so by putting all these values here so uh, 250 into 104 and plus time saving is uh, 250 minus 150 is equal to 90 into 8 hours is equal to 104 into 50 percent we will get 20,280 wages income gross earnings of the all uh, workers engaged in completing this task now uh, prepare cost of goods source statement for the month of the January so in order to complete this uh, requirement we have other information uh, given in the questions, uh, factory our factory our health, rupees forty five thousand, closing finished goods rupees fifteen thousand, closing working process uh, rupees fifteen thousand. No uh, opening or uh, beginning balances of uh, closing finished goods and closing working process is given. So here is the cost of goods source statement for the year ending. You you could be write it here the company name uh, at the top of uh, these two lines. So cost of debt material use is if opening is 10,549 we can uh, get this information from the leather uh, material ledger part this one this is the opening one and after that we are going to purchasing this amount and less closing inventory so we will get uh, this uh, debt labor after uh, uh -huh. after summing up this we will get cost of Direct material use here 546.049, direct labor is 20,280. So, prime cost, which is also called debt cost, uh, which is obtained by adding this consumed and this one 20, so we will get 566.329. Now, we are going to get total factor cost uh, factory cost. For this, we need to add the factory overhead, which is given 45,000. So, by adding these two, we will get uh, 600. 611,329 after that we don't have uh, opening or uh, uh, additional work in progress or process so we have only information regarding the closing work in process or progress uh, so we are going to less this amount 15,000 so we will get cost of goods manufacture uh, 596,329 after that we don't have again beginning or opening balance regarding the finished goods and uh, uh, <coughs> and any other additional uh, information so we have only uh, information that is the closing finished goods so we are going to less this from this amount 596 under 29.00 uh, minus 5000 so we we'll get finally cost of goods 
cost of goods sold so cost of goods sold we have finally the figure of cost of goods sold which is equal to 600 1329 at the end uh, I am going to make a request if you found any um, let me check yes 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 this is 5000 and let me check this is finished food finished food is 15000 it will be uh, detected at the end so I am going to be detected from the end and the finish closing work in process is and uh, detecting before the closing uh, finish course so here is the one okay now this is the correct one let me check this one uh, this is minus sorry i didn't sign minus so now the uh, after correction the cost of goods sold is equal to 621,329 so if you found any mistake regarding uh, like this one or regarding the calculation please mention in the comment section or if you add something from your own side and uh, drop your comments in the comment section uh, or if you want to uh, discuss any point of this solution uh, comment section is in front of you thanks for watching assalamu alaikum